We're going to do the FAST exam, the pelvic view in a female now. Again, we have the phase array transducer. Here's a probe marker right here. We're going to start off with a sagittal view, and ideally, the bladder is full. So we go just above the symphysis pubis. So we're scanning now here sagittally, and some of the anatomic landmarks that we're looking at, at the very top of the screen is the bladder, which is an anechoic structure, fluid filled obviously with urine. It's got nice walls around it. Just below that is the uterus, which is a pear-shaped organ. You can see it well visualized because, because the bladder is full. And just below that is a potential space, the cul-de-sac, where we can look for very carefully small amounts of free fluid. When we scan this patient in this view, in a sagittal view, from the patient's left to the patient's right, and we're slowly, slowly scanning to see if there's any evidence of free fluid. Once we finish the sagittal view, we want to go ahead and do a transverse view. What we're going to do now is point the transducer marker toward the patient's right. So we're going to rotate that transducer toward the patient's right. Again, we see the bladder in the center of the screen. We're now going to scan from inferior, just below the, the symphysis, to more superior. And in between, we're also going to identify the uterus. So we're going right to the very top of the bladder, to about mid-bladder, we can see the uterus here in the center. A very small amount of free fluid here, which can be physiological as well. So we're scanning all the way inferiorly. To more superiorly, we see the uterus. We actually see part of the ovary there. And then we're going to go all the way more superiorly.